Welcome to Alex Express. I got some more updates for you guys. Last week, YouTube presented a new mid row where you could add mid rows with eight minute videos instead of 10 and over. And you'll also, the video must not be for kids and it has to have enough data on there. Like you, you gotta have a lot of information, you know, to make sure it qualifies. But you was wondering that, that YouTube's gonna release that. Well, YouTube is gonna release that, that eight minute mid row ad button on July 15th. For 20% of the people, of all the YouTube creators, tomorrow, July 15th, 20% of creators will see that opportunities for them to have eight minute videos with, with mid rows placed in. Okay, the next update is audience retention data. Audience retention. Like how do you keep the people watching? Yeah. Right under the engagement tab, you're gonna see audience retention data. That's a really important button to to understand how your video is performing and YouTube is going to make it easier to understand the button they're even going to include you on on an experiment with this feature it's going to allow you to look at your audience retention data across your whole channel is an experiment they're going to let you participate in this experiment see this will help you fix the video um, have an idea on how the video is working on a wider scale. You can figure out what weaknesses your videos are. This is going to give you a chance to look on a deeper scale on, a de on how your videos are performing from your audience. Such as at what point does your audience stay and participate and at what point did they leave? When they now YouTube will let you participate in this experiment. Um, you got to have at least 20 videos that has 100 views or more. Again, the videos must not be made for kids. Now to be part of this experiment, um, there's a link below, I'll put it in there. With, these are people that work at YouTube, that have, the, that have a YouTube channel. Um, to create Insider, you say you wanna be part of the experiment, leave a comment and they'll make you part of the experiment if you want. Okay, the second update is the ability to manage community posts in the Creator Studio. Which one of my image posts is getting the most likes? Well now, you can filter it by sort by likes. So you see which one has the most likes and how many likes and all that. Now you can respond to all, all remarks, all posts within Creator Studio now with the new feature. The, the third update is YouTube Kids application is going to be launched in four more countries. Estonia, Latvia, Lithuania. Don't forget, like always, I'm going to bring more updates. And like always, I YouTube love y'all. I am out.